All right, we're tasting pumpkin blossom traditional meat. It is uh, May and July. It's been set for a while. As you noted, it has a pretty nice looking color. You said it was like what? I think it looks like in Jurassic Park when they find the mosquito in that amber. Mm-hmm. And they put it on top of the cane, the guy's cane. <laughs> this could be like on the top of the cane. This is, just put this, I'll, I'll take a <laughs> still and put that on top of That's a cane. That's what it looks like. Yeah, no, and it's super clear. What's it smell like to you? It's kind of Pumpkin very, blossom it's, has a very- It's a very, um, I was like honey, but I don't uh -huh. really know how to describe it very well. I feel like it has a little bit of a maple. Yeah, character. I was gonna say it's like thick, like mm -hmm. syrupy. But pumpkin also has like a little spiciness to it. It's got like to me a little bit of like a um, like a baking spice, a rich. But it's not pumpkin flavored, right? Mm -hmm. No, it's like I mean it's the process of the bees pollinating on pumpkin plant, like that whole pollination process. Hmm. So it gets some of the characters, but it's not not gonna taste like pumpkin. I mean, not gonna be like you're eating a pumpkin. But it has a spice character, is what I'm trying to say. It's mm. interesting. You wanna try it? What did you do? Is it just straight? It's just, is I mean, you... I put oak on I oaked it. I was gonna it. say, did you it's oak it? It's an oaked traditional. It's basically all it is. Which they're about to, we're doing this backwards if, you've, if you're watching this. I'm gonna try. Okay. Mm. It's interesting. Hot. Mm -hmm. I don't hate it. It's just really, it's pretty hot. It is. Which is odd because we're four and a half months now since mm. I made it. Would you have expected it to mellow out some? Yeah, it should have mellowed out quite a bit. It's got interesting character at least. Yeah, it does. It just hits, the, it just hits pretty hard at the beginning. And the oak is, I feel like the oak is um, a more aggressive than I want it to be. Well, I like oaked things, so I don't right. really mind that you don't, so much. Yeah. <laughs> I but, feel like it's... It's actually a lot brighter than what I thought that it was mm -hmm. going to be. The like nose when on you, it is really cause warm. The, exactly, because it smells like it's going to be really thick and syrupy and have like warm undertones, but it's actually kind of bright. Yeah. Do you feel like that? <clears throat> no, I, I get. It. I also get like a. But I can't tell if the heat is making it feel brighter than it is. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I'm also getting a little bit of a medicinal note from this thing, like a cough syrup, cherry style kind of situation, grape, like. And that's, it's turning me off some from it. Like, I don't love this kind of honey. I'll, I'll just, I'll just say, that's not my favorite. And all the things I've made, all with the honey varietals, this one was the most weird. Like the honey tasted weird? Mm-hmm. So that, and I don't really love the product here. I mean, I feel like I did my normal process, but. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I feel like if you did the same thing you do for the other ones, there you've had some other really good, mm -hmm. Just but, like straight traditionals. This one just, the the color's pretty. Yeah, the color's pretty. <laughs> smells, honestly, the nose is nice and the color's pretty, but to me the, the yeah, taste, the taste of it is kind not. Of... But I, I think that's attributing to the honey. I mean, that's the thing is honey is its own flavor, has its own flavors, so I think it's just I'd be curious kind of though to see how it ages. It might mm -hmm. age out better than some of the other ones. I don't know. Yeah. Well. Maybe it's just a little too young. Maybe so. Definitely needs, I think, past four months. It is 13%, so four months is pretty young for 13%, I would say. How long would you usually? Mm, maybe seven or eight months would be like a good good step, next step to see where it's at, so. Do you feel like this one, like when you were making this one, that you could tell in your tastings, or did you? T is this your first time you've tasted it? At no, all? I, I've tasted it a long time ago, but I forgot. I didn't taste it when I bottled it. Um, I tr purposely tried not to. To hmm. so. I was gonna say, did you feel like that was this is different or has mel? You know what I mean? Like, mm -hmm. to see if it has mellowed out at all. But if you had didn't taste it, when you I definitely think it, it has. To know. I don't know. I didn't write down any yeah, tasting that's notes. That's okay. I just was curious. Well, we've tasted it. Now we get to see how it was made. So here you go. Bye. 
Thank you. 